Okay, hey collector. So this is part two. Uh, let's go ahead and try to find out who this individual is. Spirit, who is this individual? Who is this individual? Or this group of people? Well, we got surprise here, so it's definitely going to be shocking when this comes out. We have child support, we have spirit has your back, and we have foodie. This could be in regards to someone that's going, uh, I'm hearing through child support, possibly through court. Someone could be, uh, like a chef. I keep getting, kept getting the chef card out here for the past couple, uh, readings. But also, like, someone could be a foodie. Someone could have some type of food addiction as well. Yeah. This may definitely, this person may definitely try to surprise you or pop up on you. This person is very much obsessed. This could, like I said, this could be someone that you have a child with. Or it could be in uh, some type of custody dealings with. Yeah, divine masculine energy. Party, party, party. Celebrations, third party. And we have life path uh, 11. Well, I just said 11. You could be dealing with a life path 11. But life path 22. Master builder. Someone is trying to build up some type of plot or plan. Whoever this individual is, possibly working with a third party. Definitely, we got masculine out here again. This person is not a divine masculine. But someone could be also doing this to a divine masculine as well. And this could come as a surprise. Definitely with this child support here. But spirit has your back. Like I said, I'm hearing this plot is going to be foiled. And I also did a reading title, being, Getting Blackmailed by the Three Stooges. So this could be a group of individuals because you decided you didn't want to engage with this individual. You didn't want to be in a connection. You ended a connection. Someone could definitely be trying to plot, plan, or set someone up. Trying to surprise them. So here is surprise. Here is child support. This is pertaining to child support. Now, I'm asking who is this individual. Matter of fact, let me move these. I'm going to move these cards over here up out the way because I want to find out who this person is. So, you can have a good idea of who this person is that's trying to come in and do this. Yeah, so we have spirit has your back. So, you are definitely divinely protected. We have a foodie. So, that could be significant. Food could be significant to this individual. Yeah, we have life path 11. I mean, 20, I keep seeing life path 11. 11 could be significant to you. You could be seeing 11, 11 a lot or 11 a lot. Yeah, someone's definitely working with a third party with this party, party, party. Someone is also trying to have some type of celebration. Like I said, if someone's trying to do this for an insurance policy, someone could be trying to um, have some type of celebration. Someone could be trying to harvest someone's divine masculine energy. Who is this individual? Who is this individual or this group of people, this third party? Okay, so we have fake friends. Okay, now the past couple readings I've done, it's been a Gemini out here doing this. Or this could be happening to a Gemini. But Gemini is out here twice. Capricorn is out here as well. We have winning here. We have surrender. Like I said, someone is definitely surrendering to a situation. Someone could be trying to, this could be a blackmail situation. But for some, I'm getting that someone could be trying to set up someone in regards to actually like trying to harm someone. But someone sees someone winning, surrendering, moving on from a connection. You got Gemini here. You got fake friends. You have magician. Fuck boy, lame, power hungry, and be thankful. This Gemini could be working with a third party. Definitely with the surrender and winning. Like someone could be trying to get someone to surrender over a, a state, some money. They feel like they're trying to win. We have magicians. Someone could be using spell work to do this as well. But I'm getting that someone is trying to alter. I'm hearing alter realities 
shift personality. Someone can have a personality disorder. Someone definitely have to be a sociopath, psychopath, some type of personality disorder to be this obsessed. This person is obsessed with finances and power. And this person is working with a third party in order to try to take some. I'm here to take you down. I'm also hearing I want to take you down by uh, the song by Chris Brown. But someone is not trying to take someone down in that kind of way. Like I said, though, someone definitely could have been manipulating someone sexually. But someone is wanting to take somebody down. I'm hearing down for the count. Yeah. What, and also that um, Most High by um, Tory Lane. I had love for them, so they count me out. And also, they mad because I swung they bitches like a roundabout. I want to say that those are the lyrics. I'm also going to link that song in the description box below this video. So here's winning. Someone sees you winning. Definitely with this party, 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 they see you celebrating. This person, this could be in regards to a child and child support. I'm also here at a failed attempt. Someone could have attempted to try to get someone on child support. With the surprise here, it actually backfired on them. Now this person is upset. This person could be trying to get some type of revenge because this person is power hungry. But you are definitely divinely guided and protected because you are a divine energy. So I could be speaking to a divine masculine. Yeah, and you're winning. Yeah, you surrender to this situation is the message that I'm getting. I'm also getting if you did end up having to ch pay child support, you've also accepted that, but you're accepting still that you don't want anything to do with this individual. Possibly this Gemini here. I don't know if I showed you surrender, but there is surrender. Here's Gemini. Here is fake friends. If you thought that you can trust this individual, you cannot trust whoever this individual is. We have magician here because this person is very, very manipulative. And I'm here like trickster. Yeah, this person is very, very power hungry as well with this power hunger here, hungry here. We have, uh, and that's more energy with that food here. So food can be definitely significant to you or this individual. But like I said, the chef car been coming out. We have fuckboy lane, male or female. I'm getting that this is definitely a, a, a feminine energy and a masculine energy. Trying to plot something. Yeah, spirit is telling you to be thankful because you definitely possibly, I'm hearing you definitely possibly escaped a plot. I'm hearing for some a plot on, a plot, someone was plotting on someone. Who is this individual? Who is this individual? destination trip destination i'm also hearing destination shopping or destination food you could that could be what the food is you can also travel to different def destinations That's something you could have deal with this individual in regards to food yeah we have gossip here someone could be also gossiping about someone moving away from someone we have black sheep of the family we have ptsd and the ptsd song was in the previous video so you might want to check out that video i mean you know i'm definitely going to link them together but yeah we have ptsd here we have health care We already had isolation. Someone definitely tried to get somebody isolated or have someone isolated away from a group of individuals. I'm also hearing Sarah. You moving away from this individual. This person could be trying to also travel to wherever you are. This person could be trying to come to wherever you are with this trip here. This person could be saying, like, trying to say, like, you're leaving me out or whatever with this black sheep of the family. Definitely with this PTSD, someone could be trying to put on some type of waterworks in regards to trying to get in. Yeah. Or someone could also use health care to try to get a door in. So someone could try to use their health. Like, you you rejecting me is severely affecting my health and you know no because you are in the energy of surrender and expect accepting and also realizing that you are not responsible like people have may have also tried to put a lot of burdens on you in the past trying to make you feel like you are responsible for their behavior that you are responsible for their emotions that you are responsible for their decision making like this person may have been very very burdensome to you or to whoever this individual is. So here is trip here. Here is gossip. Someone could also be gossiping about you going on a trip. Here is black sheep of the family. Here is PTSD. And then we got life takes time and every day is a gift. You are also looking every day, looking at every day as a gift because you got away from this individual. 
I keep hearing plot. Yeah. Yeah. You could have found out. Someone could have informed you of this with this, this content here. But you are definitely at peace with yourself. Yeah, this could definitely be a child's mother or father. I thought somebody said something. Yeah, someone could definitely be trying to talk shit on you online. With this content here, I thought somebody said something and not a friendly. You realizing that this person does not have your best interest at heart. I'm also getting I'm also hearing pyramids of Giza. But I'm definitely getting that um someone definitely tried. I'm hearing they tried it. Someone could be trying to trigger you online. Also with some type of content. This person is not a friendly. Someone that you may have had a, a child with, possibly a daughter. Yeah. Somebody is mad. Someone is big mad. Yeah. Go ahead. Make my day. Quotes by uh the movie Dirty Harry. Someone's name could be Harry. But you moving away from whoever this individual is. You are pe you at are at peace with yourself. Don't stress, do your best, forget the rest. That's what you're doing. Like, this person may be trying to talk shit. I'm getting that you are also calling this individual on their shit. I'm hearing that you are not allowing individuals. I'm hearing to sneak this. So here is mother or father. Here is content. So this is clarifying whoever this individual is. So this is possibly a child's mother or father that's talking shit. If you feel like somebody is slighting you or sending, like, I'm hearing jabs or side jabs. I don't know. I don't know someone getting... Oh, wow. I keep hearing the jab. So that could be significant to you. But um, I'm definitely getting that uh, someone is like t trying to talk shit and you're not allowing that. If you think that someone is doing that and uh, you may think that they are talking about you, they are. Here is not a friendly because this person is not a friendly. This person does not have your best interests at heart. Like I said, this could be this could be a daughter. Definitely if it's pertaining to a, a estate. This could actually be a daughter, someone's daughter that's doing this. But this definitely with that mother, father out here, this definitely could be someone's daughter or someone you have a child with. Someone is mad, though. Yeah, go ahead, make my day. you like, I wish a bitch would. Who is this individual? What is this individual being exposed? Yeah. Ritual. We got ritual here. We have beware. We have can't hold me back. So someone was trying to do some type of ritual to hold you back. I'm also getting, yeah, a game. Or someone was trying to play some type of games. I'm also getting, you may not have um, expected this individual to do this. But I'm also hearing I, le I learned from the best. So someone, you actually could have legit taught someone something. And they tried to use it against you. But yeah, Spirit's telling you to beware of this individual. Because this individual is definitely trying to hold you back. From bossing up. Here is ritual. Here is. Wow. Spirit has your back. That already came out. So I guess they want you to see that again. But you are definitely protected. Spirit is telling you to be very aware and mindful of this individual. Because this person is trying to hold you back. Like I said. Definitely with some type of spell work. And trying to prevent you from bossing up. Then we have payback. This is somebody trying to get payback. Your guides are proud of you, but your spirit guides are definitely proud of you for moving on from this individual. Yeah, we got spiritual court here. We have gamer. We have influencer. You could be dealing with an influencer. You could legit be a gaming uh, influencer. Like, you can play video games online. Yeah, and have a big following. But your guides are definitely proud of you. This is being judged, and I'm hearing a spiritual court. I'm also hearing court of law. So, like I said, someone definitely could be trying to take you to court or do something or expose something. I'm also getting for some, this could have been exposed to you. Someone could have had a plot to do something to harm you, and an agency had to inform you of what's actually going on. That could be what this energy is. Someone was plotting on someone, though, and this is being unearthed. This is being exposed because someone wanted some type of payback here. Where are we at? 14 minutes. Yeah, someone wanted some type of payback, but your guys are definitely proud of you. This is being handled in spiritual court as well. Like I said, multiple um, as above, so below. So what is uh, being brought to justice here is also being brought to ju justice in spiritual court as well. Yeah, here is Gamer. 
and here is influence. So you can definitely be an influencer. Yeah, the universe is trying to reveal itself to you. The universe is trying to aid, assist, and guide you in this. I'm hearing this endeavor. Yeah, you could definitely be overseas, and we have authenticity. So you are very much. I'm also hearing ethnic. Ethnic? Ethnic? Hmm. But you are also very, very authentic. You definitely could be located overseas. Like I said, this could be happening overseas, possibly in the UK. I'm also hearing across the pond. Maybe in the universe, maybe the universe is trying to reveal something to you via overseas. Regardless, it's, you got the hint. I'm getting you got the hint and you moved away from an individual. I'm also hearing it probably uh, very much saved you from going into a severe tower moment. Here is authenticity here. Oh, wow. That was my phone. Just fell. Yeah. Hmm. Yep. When pain brings you down, don't be silly. Don't close your eyes and cry. But just you just might be in the best place. I cannot. When pain brings you down, don't be silly. Don't close your eyes and cry. You just might be in the best position to see the sunshine. You could definitely have a sun with someone. But you're seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. You're definitely pulling your power back. But this is Atlantis Morset. And guess what Atlantis Morset is? Correct. A Gemini. Well, she's also a singer. But she's a Gemini. Yep. Pause before speaking. You may decide to keep your thoughts to yourself. Forgive yourself. You've done nothing wrong. Someone is using you. You realize this person was using you and you decide to get out of this. And spirit is definitely telling you that you made the correct decision. Yeah, to leave. But you definitely need to uh, forgive yourself. Also, you are, I'm here. you may also be wanting to communicate something or express something. You may be having to express something in court. Spirit is telling you definitely to take um, a moment to get your thoughts together. Because, and you are going back and forth. You definitely need to speak up. Whatever this situation is, you definitely need to speak up. Forgive yourself. Because you may feel like, uh... Definitely, if you react in some kind of way, you could feel guilty or feel like you played a hand in this. No, you did not. Speak your truth even if your voice shakes. You may definitely watch Infinite Waters. You may want to check out his channel. Yeah, my voice just cracked. So you definitely may be very nervous in regards to, to speaking your truth. Yeah, you realize someone was definitely using you and playing you, though. And whatever it is that you are considering going for, you should go for it because someone was definitely trying to hold you back from an opportunity. Whether that's just going for, you know, being alone, go for it. Like, yeah, definitely from this person. This person, oh, is very sick. Yeah, forgive yourself. You've done nothing wrong. I'm getting that you definitely already know who this individual is. Definitely as much as Gemini came out. Gemini came out repeatedly. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. After this, I'm going to get you some advice. Yeah, business partnership. You may definitely be considering going towards a business partnership, possibly with a Virgo. Or you can have Virgo placements. Or you can be considering doing this. I said something was going to happen in the month of August. Virgo is August 23rd to September, through September 22nd. So you definitely could be uh, considering doing something here soon. Going towards some type of business partnership here soon. That could be why your voice is cracking. Like you have to get out of this situation to go towards this new business partnership. Yeah, no cap. Well, that says cap captain. So someone definitely capping. But we got cap here. We have addiction here. We have sun here. We have trap. Like I said, someone was definitely trying to trap you in a situation. It's like I said, this person was very much obsessive. It's just like telling the same story over and over again. But you're definitely considering going towards a new partnership. You realize that you are keeping up appearances with a specific individual. And now you want to move on from this energy. It's the same energy. You realize that you are in a relationship or a connection with somebody that was a liar. Maybe that is who this individual was. You could have been dealing with someone with Gemini placements or Virgo placements in their chart. 
or like I said, you could be this sign, these signs as well. Don't get fixated on the signs, but I'm definitely feeling that you definitely know who this individual is. Someone also could have been trying to convince you to go into a partnership, but you're you're gone anyway. You left. Like I said, someone definitely could be coming towards you to expose that someone was trying to do something, set you up in some kind of way. Now, whether or not this is happening um, on on three D with like the actual police, Interpol, FBI. Well, Interpol is the FBI and all of those agencies working together, but. I'm definitely getting that whether it's happening like that or whether or not like a spiritual court is helping you and you are getting information about this individual through tarot and you're finding out that this person has some type of plot against you. Now, this person could be just trying to destroy you spiritually with that fragmented and buried like this person may not be literally contemplating burying you in the woods, but this person could be trying to split you in half spiritually. And I'm hearing spiritual suicide. This person definitely could be trying to, or could have. Whatever the case is, you're getting, uh, I'm hearing higher counsel, higher guidance. Yeah, I'm also hearing, yeah, counsel, divine counsel. But this person is also being judged on 3D and 5D. So here's Virgo. So someone definitely could have been stalking someone. Yeah, look. Cap Captain fell out my hand. Someone definitely could be could have been capping. Someone could have had some type of addiction, obsession with you as well. They wanted you trapped in a situation, possibly with a son. I'm definitely speaking to a masculine energy, though. I'm definitely feeling like a masculine energy is here. I'm definitely, there's multiple scenarios that's happening here. This is happening to a masculine and a feminine. I could just, I could feel your energy. Here is keeping up appearances, and here is move on. You're definitely moving on from someone. You realize that you or maybe this person was trying to keep up some type of appearances with you. Like trying to keep you in a connection. Maybe for clout. Let me get you some advice. Yeah. Like I said, some could be being exposed here in the month of August. Someone could be exposing to you that someone has some type of plot on you to maybe, like I said, trap you, sabotage you, keep you from moving forward because they have some type of obsession, but it's not going to work. Okay, Spirit, what advice do you have for the collective in regards to this situation? Yeah, coffee, and that's, I flip, yeah reverse i am abundant you are abundant like this person you're no longer in anxiety you're no longer crying over this individual you see that you're no longer in uh that distorted energy that this individual tried to have you in you are realizing that you are abundant you are divine and you're moving on from whoever this individual is advice Yeah, my little card is bent up. Hmm. Vegan here, bloom. Yeah, and it's a lot of red here. Red could be significant to you as well. You can also like to visit like bistros as well. But we have uh yeah, you could be visiting a vegan bistro or you know that could been um you could have met this person at a bistro. Um, yeah. But like I said, you could definitely be vegan. Here's Bloom and vegan. Mm-hmm. I'm also hearing stars in the night sky. So you can like to stargaze a lot. Oh, wow. You could also, also be into um, Buddhism. Taoism because I don't know if you're going to be able to see this and I've never seen this in this card like that's what I love about these cards like spirit gave me you know led me to the pictures to use and every day I realize something new about the card so down there back in the corner it's a little face a little Buddha face like uh, you probably ain't going to be able to see that but yeah yep I'm also hearing, yeah, and I'm also hearing zealots. 
because I'm hearing the line when he said, um, gave me a chance to grab my pen and revamp. Do the tango while everybody do the dance. So you definitely could be into dancing as well. But you are, uh, or yoga with this and breathe. You definitely could be doing yoga as well. I'm also going to link that song in the description box below as well. That's one of my favorite songs actually. Yeah, this is going to be a timeless message. Yeah. But you, uh, you definitely realizing that. This person missed out on an opportunity. You could also be traveling to, uh, I'm hearing also uh, Mississippi. I'm also hearing the Midwest. Or you could be located in this area. But yeah, you're definitely realizing that. Wow, less time. <laughs> I was drawn to less time to read it backwards. Yeah, you definitely did not miss out on an opportunity. This person, you... Um, averted a major catastrophe that's what i'm getting someone was trying to get you in a, a mental prison but yeah here's timeless and here is miss yeah you could be divorcing from this person i'm also hearing miss lady oh that's way far too many but yeah someone definitely tried to have you in illusions but i'm definitely hearing miss lady Yeah, love. You're definitely possibly going towards a new connection. And you're using your intuition as well. And you may definitely need to... You may definitely be... That could have been what you were uh, afraid of speaking up on. Definitely with this and breathe here. Yeah, this... And I'm fumbling like cars. Like, you could be very, very nervous. Give me just a second. You could be very, very nervous in regards to this. Yeah, you could feel like you're running out of time. Because here's another... Uh, clock here and i was getting less time like you may be feeling like you're running out of time and you're gonna miss the opportunity from dealing with this mess yeah so here is intuitive uh spirit is telling you to use your intuition operate in your heart space when going towards this new opportunity and breathe relax to help you move forward Anything else? And I'm going to close it out. Yep. This must be the place. You know where you're going. You know, you know, you know. When you know, you know. So, get out your head. You get a new opportunity, a new start to move forward away from this chaos and confusion and all of this messiness. And, and you know, take your power back. So, I'm going to go ahead and end it there. Wow. I want to say, uh, you know, please feel free to, to like, share, and subscribe if this resonated with you. But, gosh, like, I kind of hope it didn't resonate for anybody. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and end it there. You have a blessed day. All right. Bye, collective.